Well, as we line up for event one, Super Stockers, Heat one, eight laps of journey. It looks like Kerry Thomas, the pole sitter. On the outside, it should be uh, Brad Norris. Bob McCosker's there in uh, any one car, it is. I hope I'm calling the right name. He's in the right position anyway. Go racing this time. They hit the white line as Kerry Thomas. Oh, and that's the uh, 81 car. He's all over the place over there. Clipping the fence after the start. Green light still on racing. Kerry Thomas still in the race lead. As he's led the first lap, Bob McCosker back there in second spot in 39. Then we go back there, the 80 car. Ben Chopping, then there's a gap back to Michael Johnson. Also there, Anthony Ole. I think the 81 car of the Norris car having plenty of troubles there. Spilling to the infield, tripping on the flashing embers. He's sitting there right on the uh, right on the line of the uh, pole line of the turn four. With Kerry Thomas leading the race. Bob the cop. Ready to go racing this time I feel Kerry Thomas. Can he lead to the flag from here? He's off and racing. Hits turn one and two. McCosker's right on his hammer. Then we go back there to uh, Anthony Oles trying to make a move on Choppy. Round the outside goes Anthony Oles on Choppy. Puts him back to fourth spot. Then we go back to Michael Johnson. Also, uh, also Hayden Thomas there. Along with the 65 car of Daniel Pierce. Michael Thomas now is trying to put his back on... Uh, on chopping, but that's the way they stay as they complete another lap. Kerry Thomas, the race leader, gee. Anthony Ole just went trip past the Koska. As he was standing still, he's got the leader in his sights. The Koska in third place on the racetrack, Johnson fourth. Then it's back there with chopping. Also, uh, Hayden Thomas. And uh, Daniel Pierce. Now Anthony Ole takes over the race lead from Kerry Thomas. Must be only a handful of laps to go. Thomas back to second, back there with McCosker. In third spot from uh, Michael Johnson. McCosker now trying to put his mark on Thomas. Let him know he's there in third spot. Johnson now around the outside for a look on McCosker, but pokes his nose back there behind the, uh, the number 39 car. McCosker now, three wide as they come out, turn four with jagged flag. I feel would go to uh, Anthony Ole. I'd say it could have been Michael Johnson from here. And then it'll be a toss up from Kerry Thomas or even uh, Ben Chopping in the, in the uh, number 80 car. And this small field of six cars. But gee, what a quality field. Danny Lennon, Jeffrey O, Brent Scott, Dennis Booth. Time ready to go racing. Lennon hits the white line. That's how they go into turn one. G. Brent Scott. He made a big move on uh, the sixth car there of, uh, of uh, sorry, Jeffrey Ohl. Dennis Booth up there in fourth position. Then we go back to the 43 car of Jeff Scott. 
Mark Hogan trying to make a move to the back of the field. But they've all got one thing in common. They're off after the race leader. That's the pumpkin man, Dan Lennon, at his best. Through turn one and two. He's about 10 car lengths in front of the next car there, Fred Scott. Trying hard to pick him up, Jeffrey Ole. Dennis back there with Dennis Moon. Also Mark Hogan. And the 43 car of Jeff Scott. Jeffrey Ole having trouble up there in turn four. Back on the race line. But Danny Lennon still holding on to the race lead. Out there in second spot, Brent Scott with Jeffrey Ole. Still back there in that third spot. Like Dan, Dan Lennon's got some problems here. Plenty of smoke billowing out from the car. As he pulls in field, the race lead now goes to the 42 car of Brenton Scott. Oh, gee, I don't think. Uh, I didn't think this is how they're going to line up. I would have thought the 42 car should have been there. But anyways, the flag drops. Jeff uh, Jeff Old takes the race lead from the number seven Cortina. There, fix the car. Sounds like Jeffrey Hull just blew one also. Mark Hogan's there in third spot. On the 42 car, Brett Scott. Second flag drops now to Jeffrey Hull. Who takes the race lead. The race win. From the number seven car. Mark Hogan third across the line. Well, a bit of bad luck there for Danny Lennon. Need a face to start at this time. Michael Johnson, Ben Chopping up the front row. Anthony Ole, he actually won the last heat. He's out of position three, Daniel Pierce. That's how they hit the line racing this time. Michael Johnson, the early race leader. Daniel Pierce wants to get up in the thick of thin things early. He's back to get third on the racetrack. But it's up with the race leader Michael Johnson. He's got about four or five car lengths over Choppy. He's back there second, not second place on the track. Then we go back to uh, Daniel Pierce. And it looks like it's uh, Kerry Thomas back at that part of the field. Ben Chopping stacks them up behind him, back over on the back straight. The race leader, Bill Michael Johnson. Anthony Hull has Chopping in his sights. Well, he goes round the outside, takes over second spot. And that puts Ben Chopping back third on the racetrack. We go back there with Daniel Pierce. Also Bob McCoska and uh, it's Kerry Thomas.
Then the old, driving like honey and old nose, and that's hard. Foot flat to the floor. Off after the race leader, has him in his sights. Going to set him up for a move shortly, I feel. That's Michael Johnson, the race leader. Oh, makes him move on the inside. Takes the race lead. Michael Johnson back there in second spot. Then we go back there with Ben Chopping. Also Daniel Pierce and Bob McCosker. Second flag goes to uh, the 53 car. Put your hands together, race fans. A great drive. Excuse me, Anthony Old the wheel takes the race win from uh, second car. I thought it was uh, Michael Johnson. Start this time. Yeah, then it looks to be fired up. Got to the last heat. Uh, hit the line, Jeffrey Ole. There's Carter turn, uh, turn one. Then he's followed too by uh, Jeff Scott. Also, Dennis Lee. Sorry, Big Danny Lennon's got the uh, Commodore all fired up. This time, he's up there second spot. Right on the bumper of Jeffrey Old gives him a tap. Let's him know he's there. The follow through there by Jeff Scott. Also Dennis Booth. Sorry, 43's up there also. Jeff Scott it is. Brent Scott, sorry. He's up there third on the race. They saw themselves out, I saw myself out. It's Jeff Hall, still the race leader. And it's back there with Danny Lennon. Puts the move on Hall now in the first spot. Jeffrey Hall back to second. And it's back there, Brent Scott third on the race track. Dennis Booth. And it will be Jeff Scott in 43. One lap to go to the race leader, that's Danny Lennon. Commanding lead over Jeffrey Old at the present time as the white flag's on this way. Then we go back to the far. Uh, Brent Scott at 42. And it's Booth. He's full car across the line. That's how they're going to finish race fans, Danny Lennon. Taking the race win from Jeffrey Ole. Second car across the line. Then we have Brenton Scott. Dennis Booth. Followed through there by the 43 car of Jeff Scott.
459909. 459909. Read the other two out very shortly. Ready to start this race. There we go this time. Looks like we have Anthony Ohl off the pole position. That's how they hit turn one. Back to the uh, raffle. Scratchy tree, four, five, nine, triple six. Scratchy tree, four, five, nine, triple six. A double movie pass, four, five, double nine, six, one. A movie pass. Four, five, double. Yeah, In turn one and two. Peter Bob Lacoska. He's up there in second spot. Then we go back to Kerry Thomas. Also, there would be uh, Ben Chopping, Michael, Michael Johnson's there, along with the, with the 65 car. The G. Anthony Ohl, he's going to try and make it three out of three tonight. Might be a chip off the old block here. As he's uh, got a handsome race lead. Back there in second spot, Bob Lacoste. We go back there with uh, Kerry Thomas. Also the uh, 80 car of Ben Chopping. Michael Johnson's up there running about. Also fifth on the race track. Johnson putting a move there on Ben Chopping. Got Kerry Thomas in his sights. We'll find the race leader. Anthony Ohl goes through turn three and four. Got Bob McCosker. Second on the racetrack, McCosker. Then we find uh, Kerry Thomas along with Michael Johnson. Flag out for the race leader. Anthony Old takes it. Takes the checkered flag, makes a three out of three race fans. Send the car across the line, Bob Matoska. Great show put on the night by uh, Anthony Old. Make it three out of three. leader is Brent Scott. Danny Lennon, he's up there second on the racetrack. Then we go back to the other Scott car. Oh, Jeff Scott third. Third there the present time from Dennis Booth. Also Jeffrey Ohl. Jeffrey Ohl making a move around the outside. 
He's up there behind the, the 43 car it is. Now he's in front off after the race leader. Which is the other Scott car at Brenton at the wheel. And he let him have him in his sides. Lennon. He's up there still holding on to the race lead, but he tried to uh, outsmart Lennon, but uh, Danny is not going to fall for that one. And we got uh, Jeffrey Ole up there, third on the racetrack. You go back to the field, looks like Dennis Booth. Also there, the 43 car of Jet Scott and Mark Hogan. And he's letting now opens up a uh, bit of a lead over Brenton Scott there, second spot. Jeffrey O holding on the third, third spot. Only a couple of left to go. Mark Hogan having trouble with the race back tonight. Going, to, going through turn three and four. But the white flag's on display, one lap to go. Jenny Lennon, the race leader. And it's back there with Brenton Scott. Jeffrey Ole still filling third position. From uh, Dennis Booth, can we go back there to the other Scott car? 43 car, in fact, of Jeffrey at the wheel and also Mark Hogan. But checkered flag time race fans to Danny Lennon. Brenton Scott's second car across the line from Jeffrey Ole. And also uh, Dennis Booth. Well, a great drive there by Danny Lennon. As uh, he fought it out with Brenton Scott there with the race lead for a while. And he showed great speed. He'll lead him away from pole position. And have a look, he's on the outside of him. Daddy Dearest on the outside of car six. And all old family front row. Thank you, fluorescent orange shirts. Are you busy, Marilyn? You're a good girl. At least you don't have to get the wide angle. They're all at the front. Rodeo, Superstock, a final 15 laps the distance. Anthony Old just smokes the old boy from the start. Right up into the boards is Hogan. Wow, all sorts of action through this small stocker field. Here comes Denny Lennon. Down the inside of Mick Johnson in car two. First time out tonight for Danny this season. So it's Anthony Ole and Jeffrey Ole. Brenton Scott up into the fence in car 42. Anthony Ole, Jeffrey Ole and Danny Lennon. Then Mick Johnson and Bob McCosker. Brenton Scott. Then Ben Chopping and Mark Hogan. Daniel Pierce and Jeff Scott round out the field. Now back to the old family at the front. Oh, here comes Danny Lennon. Lennon down the inside. Oh, the pair of them are up into the fence. Oh, Lennon and all into the boards. And Mickey Johnson was a big winner. Mick Johnson down the inside of Lennon. Brand new engine for car number two tonight. Oh, and Lennon into the side of him as well. Oh, push for Mick Johnson and Lennon down the inside. All sorts of action all over the racetrack here for the Stockers. But Anthony O wants none of it. He is gone. Car 53 of Anthony O out in front. Puts another one in the books. Then it's Danny Lennon, Mick Johnson and Jeffrey O going at it for third and fourth. Then Bob McCosker and Ben Chopping in 80. 
than its last race meetings winner. Mark Hogan in 72, not having a great run tonight. Problems for car 39 of Bob McCosker, the supercharged Falcon. That car is running lean. Have a look on the underside of car 39, folks. The exhaust pipe is glowing. That car is screaming for some more fuel. But Bob McCosker is dropping the hammer. He doesn't care. Problems for, uh, for the all-red machine of Mark Hogan. Now, where on earth am I? Back to Anthony Ohl. Crossing the start-finish line again with another lap. Then Danny Lennon. Then Mick Johnson in car two. Then Jeffrey Ohl. Oh, here goes Hogan. Hogan all the way around onto the infield. Fiery's having a good look at that car. Now he definitely has problems there. He will pull to the infield. Righto, let's get some bearings here. Fiery's are also over to car 39 of Bob McCosker. Hogan looks like he wants to go again. White flag out now for our race leader. Here comes your race leader past you now, folks. Anthony Allen, 53. Denny Lennon in 17. Then it's Jeffrey Ohl. Checkered flag will fly. First time out in the brand new car and takes the race win. Now, have we got some carnage on the infield? We got some dead cars in the cool down area and it's gone all the way to the checkered too, all the way to the back of this field. Wow, what a final that one for the Stockers. Anthony Ohl taking the race win. Danny Lennon there in position number two. Then it's back to the second part of the Ohl family. Jeffrey Ohl in car number six. Here comes Dan the Man, folks. First appearance this season for Danny Lennon. How about it for the old family, ladies and gentlemen? Make some noise. Here we go, Donut Style. Brand new car for Anthony Old going Owie Style. Oh, great stuff. That's how we want to finish her up here at the Speedway. Now that will do us for tonight, folks. Here we go. Five past ten. The hell was that, dude? You smashed them. I don't know how far behind they were, but... Oh, oh far out, sorry. But, yeah, oh, it's good to have a win. Yeah, that's right. We've been talking about you tonight. Well, since I've had the microphone, anyway. Brand banker, and uh, you've been talking to me this week. You, you didn't even think you were going to make it tonight. But not only did you make it, you creamed them. Yeah, I have to say thanks to Sky, my fiance, for letting me race. And uh, big, big um, thank you to Chris for getting the car ready. Certainly a big family deal, folks. Now, what were you thinking when you had the old boy on the outside? And uh, did you know you blew him on the start? <laughs> Yeah, I knew I'd blow him on the start. Just a good motor that I've got. Another one coming, hopefully. Oh, I shouldn't have said that, but it's gone. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> I'm sure it's at the right price, Sky. Anyone else you want to thank, mate? Uh, Mum and Dad, Jim Bob. Um, there's a big big list. I, yeah, just run out of space on the microphone to say it all the names. But, yeah, big thank you to everyone that's given me a hand with everything. There we are, folks. One more time, make some noise for Anthony Ohl. First time out, brand new car. Smashed him. Danny's big badass B8 had nothing. Hey, six cylinder. You go, you big girl. <laughs>